Greetings, everybody. Lord Von Spoog here, and today we are playing as Black Magic. In the mid lane, this is the return of the AP Lucian you guys know and love all so well. I've had a couple practice games of this so far, and I've actually set down a build that I found that I like. So, I'm going to be showing it to you guys today. I do believe this is probably the best you're going to get for AP Lucian builds if you want to play something off meta and have fun while doing it. Um, surprisingly enough, it actually doesn't feel that bad, unironically. It takes a little bit of getting used to, for sure, because if you don't know anything about AP Lucian, Mr. AP Double Gun Obama over here, all of your damage comes from your W and your cult. So, it's... It's very interesting, and when you play Lucian, you always sit there and think to yourself, man, I want to go ham skis. You know, I want to sit there and I want to duke it out. I want to dash around, beat people, beat people up, you know, live fast, eat ass, all that jazz. But you're not really doing that. You're playing more of a poke game when you're playing the AP Lucian, just trying to you know, whittle people down with Yard and Blaze. So, I'll be showing you guys how to do that today. We are laying against a Zoe. So, this is kind of a... <laughs> it's, I mean, there's definitely been worse lanes that I, that I could play against, so... Try not to complain too much about it. And all I really need to do in this lane is be very, very aware of her drowsy. As long as I don't dash into that, should be totally, totally fine. Ooh, she whiffed. Okay, she still gets it, but she whiffed. And we are actually doing a very good job poking her down with our piercing light, because early game, your Q still does do a decent chunk to people. Um, but funny enough, that is actually going to be the ability we are leveling last. So, buckle in, we are in for a ride. I have found that I really, really like Luden's Echo first, and then I... I'm actually probably going to try a bit of a different build this game. I know I just said I hashed one out earlier, but I think I'm going to try a slightly altered version of it. The one that I hashed out that I liked was Luden's Echo uh, into Lich Bane with Transcendence. That way you get the 40% CDR, uh, and you can you know start rocking their world from there. Ooh, is this a kill for your boy? Ooh, yes! <laughs> Ardent Blaze coming in for the kill. Snagging it up. I'm sorry, Nasus. I took away your plus 12, but it was just... <sighs> oh, I had to do it to him. Anything I can to get myself that little bit of an advantage that I am going to desperately need to look really good for all my friends on YouTube. Because, you know, what's even the point if my friends on YouTube... Don't think I am just the coolest. So far, so good, though. I mean, getting first blood like that is super good for us, as well as the fact that I'm actually CSing pretty darn well. And I can afford my lost chapter right now. That's really good. Really, really good. So I'll be looking to back pretty shortly here. But one thing... Oh, God. Let me just tell you guys this right now, too. The other thing that is hard as heck to get used to is is uh, getting really good at CSing again when you're not building all the AD because as soon as you start building all this AP all the time it is tough to get used to your auto attacks doing no damage but lost chapter achieved this is our mana sustain right here we are in business not gonna miss too much off of that so that is all good in this neighborhood so the scaling on AP Lucian is actually 0.9 for the W, and it's 0.1 per shot on your calling. So over 20 shots, it's a 2.0 AP ratio. Scale's actually pretty hard. Scale's pretty hard, does a lot of damage. I could be in trouble. And nice. Okay, so that's actually not as bad as it could have been, because she actually didn't get the hit off on me until after I had woken up. But that goes to show how volatile this lane is and just how careful I need to be but she is in kill range right now damn I could have definitely killed her if I played that a little better 
But I got a little scared and chose to flash diagonally instead of directly over her because I wasn't completely confident in my ability to flash perfectly over the bubble. I don't know the timing um, precisely off the top of my head. So I took the safe route and I flashed diagonally instead, which did cost me the kill, but that is all good. So we'll force it back, make her miss some waves. Uh, Shivana did just get the dragon, so I do need to be a little aware of that. But we'll just shove that into the tower and go back again. Might as well. <laughs> Might as well. I'm not losing anything by backing right here because these waves will even out. So let's grab boots, another amplifying tome, and get hustling. Get hustling. Okay, so she has one potion. And as long as I'm actually landing these Ws, each W on a 10 second cooldown is almost 220 damage. So that's pretty solid. Pretty solid. And it's a very, very relatively easy thing to land, right? Like, it launches, it doesn't look like it has a super long range, but it actually shoots into this weird, huge uh, cross, like plus sign, whenever it explodes. And you can use that to really, really get a lot out of that range. Because as you can see, I hit right here, and it hit the minions all the way to the side. So... As you play more of this, you'll get used to that. And boom. Already got that potion out of her. And look, we are just chunking her. Actually, I'm going to go like this. And skadoosh. No! No way, dude. She just lived with like one health. Literally one health. Oh. All right. Hang on. No, I'm not going to be able to find her. Push it. Push it real good. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. All right, dash in here. Here we go. Bleep. Bleep. So I know Akali's here, but I think we can still do this. I got the ward. I got the other ward. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Ward Killer Lucian. Let's go, baby. Vision score pumping. And that will keep my boys safe. Woo. I ain't drowsy. Get that thing away from me. Get that thing away from me. All right. This is going much better this time. Woo. Ow. <laughs> Thanks, Zoe. Cool champion. Thanks, Riot Games. You know what? I'm just going to say this right now because it's an honest opinion. I legitimately think that League of Legends would just be an objectively better game if Riot removed, like, 40 champions. Truly. I really do believe this. I think it would actually improve the quality of the game by a pretty large margin. Because um, there's just so many champions now that are so... They're designed without fun in mind. They're designed for a lack of interactivity. They're designed for really just punishing people for actively trying to play the game. It, it doesn't make sense to me, but I'm not going to get into this because it gets me... Whew, really wrestles my jimmies right on up, so I'm not going to let myself get heated on that one. Not yet. Not yet. I'm just going to dash out of here to avoid that bubble 100%. And every time it's up, look for the W. Look at that range, dude. Look at it. Respect it. <laughs> Might as well just tickle her to death. Just coochie coochie coo. And get that Zoe kill because we know we are not getting away from this half-born. And we are going to die. Wait, that's a conquer, Shivana. <gasps> Damn! She's dealt eight damage with it? Damn! Damn! God damn! Dude, 90 to 47 CS so far. Not bad. Not bad. And then there's Shivana. Cinder Hulk Shivana. Wow. Okay. That Shivana, dude, she is quaking in her boots, though. Because she's like, ah, oh, fuck. That's a vein getting really fed. And I'm sitting here building 
health. Yeah, no, I bet she feels like a goon right now. It's good douche. Good poke. Not yet. Once I get this Luden's Echo, though, too, my damage just goes up so whoa, so whoa much. I did not see that minion right in my face. Otherwise, I probably could have saved my dash there. Not a big dealio, though. Let's go whip. Chunker, baby. 250 a shot. Really? Wow. Oh, uh, am I dead? Ow. Shut down. Thanks. I'm not, but fuck, man. I wonder if she's going to try and go for me. Oh, I fucking missed. Oh, my God. Oh, that's embarrassing. Okay. <laughs> Oof. Damn, dude. That sucks a lot. Our Jax has really done nothing. And he rushed a Tiamat? Oh, my lordy Lou. Oh. Dude, this Shivana is out jungling him to the max right now. And that is a, like, that was a pre-6 Shivana until a little bit ago. Just dunking all of, well, I guess it is Fleet Footwork Jax, so that's, oof. Oh, well. It do happen like that sometimes. It really do. No worries. It just kind of stinks that uh, they got an Infernal for free. And we just saw Shivana right here. Okay. Yep. Oh, I missed. Barely, barely. So I know it doesn't... Whoa. Okay. I know it... Oh, I'm flashing this. Because I think if I get hit by that E and then wait for Shivana to ult onto me and then flash, I immediately lose um, way too much health and I can't stay in lane. So I'm just gonna do a really preemptive flash instead of trying to, you know, fancy feet, put on my Nikes for anything like that, because I just don't think it's worth uh, holding the summoner for that. I wanna be able to stay in lane. So I know that looked kinda like a panic flash, but that was what I considered to be my best choice. So that should be good. We've got the coin. And as you can see, the W, since it doesn't go up in mana cost, it starts at 70, which is really expensive early, but 70 at this point is like nothing. I'm sitting there able to just spam it all the time. So I can really pump out the DPS. Unironically, dude. Really unironically here. And if she if she uses her ult again, I'm pretty sure she's dead. Ooh! Oh my god. Dude, I keep going for these combos, thinking she's gonna go other ways than she does, and then she just she just does it. Bye bye. <laughs> oh man. Give her the old clap right there. Wait. Clap back. There we go. Give her the clap back. She tried to clap me, I clap her back. Let's not give Zoe the clap. I can afford my Ludens, though, and that is good. I don't actually know where Shivana is. Okay, never mind. I know exactly where Shivana is. She's top, and I should be fine to get this turret. And this is first turret, right? Yeah. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Boom. First turret going down for the black magic. I guess you consider it. Wait. 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 Some say it's magic. I say it's good aim. I had to think of the Lucian Club. I was like, what is it? Quick. All right. Wow. This Shivana. Double the CS. One more kill participation. Two dragons. Rift Herald. She is just all over this man. Hopefully Jax can scale and still be pretty strong in team fights going forward. But damn, damn, damn. She is going ham. But 40% CDR achieved. I don't know why I bought this other book. Uh, more AP in the moment, I guess. <laughs> and now our Arden Blaze is on a 6 second cooldown, so that is not bad at all. And our Culling on a 60. So, every minute I can just rock it, And boom! The chunk! Gotta love it, dude. You want another one? I got another one for you. 
I don't. I lied. I'm gonna see if I can head bottom. Throw Demetrius right there. And maybe we can go for the hot dives. They don't have a control warden there. But, uh... Aha! Uh -huh. Wait. Back up, tear! Oh my god. They had everything! How the heck did they still have everything? Okay, whatever. That's still really good for us. I am just baffled that they had everything there. I thought my bot lane was, like, crushing them. Oh, well. Oh, no, Jax. Is he... Oh. Good try, buddy. Oh, here comes Nasus. Big dog in the house. Boom. Okay. Okay. He's... Okay. Okay, he's baby dick dog. Baby dick dog in the house. Well... Damn. You know, she is right. I shouldn't assume the way I did. I should not have assumed the way I did. Alright, well, this is just no good. All kinds of no good. And I cannot stop them from getting this third dragon now. Whew. <laughs> what is the play? My, oh my, what is the play? I don't think I'd go top here. I want to just because I want the farm and I'm greedy, but the Shivana is becoming a real huge issue. And I'm not trying to like chastise this Jax in any way, but he is truly being a problematic member of the team. And it's important to objectively understand like who the problematic members are. Um, Cause it can, it can help identify when you're trying to shift too much blame on someone else or like yourself. Like, for example, you could be mad, like, for, just for a really loose example, like, had, when I went bottom, I could be like, God damn it, this bot lane didn't call their summoner spells. For all I know, they did. I wasn't paying attention. But, a lot of this is completely due to Jax, just like, conceding all control of everything to the Shivana. And the Shivana playing well. Like, not to, not to discredit her playing well. She's just simply the better jungler right now and that's okay that's okay it's just always important to also identify where the weaknesses are <laughs> that's what i was trying to say with that boom Ooh, chunked her chunked her good 442 damage right there another one boom get another one <laughs> so much damage dude Boom! Okay, well, not that much damage to her. Feels 404 Shivana, man. You guys want another one? I got another one for you. I'm going right for Rabadons here. I want to do it. I want to do that. I think as long as Vayne handles the uh, Shivana in fights, we're totally fine. I'll be able to do the damage for like everyone else and poke him down really effectively. But Vayne is going to be like 90% of the damage on this Shivana. Boom. Ooh, she spell shielded it. She got wise this time. All right. We like that. We like that indeed. Woo. We're like a beautiful little flower. Just blooming across the rift. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Ba boom. Shut down. Wait, do you have a shutdown at 1-5-1? and one? What the fuck, Riot? Come on. Come, that's not how shutdowns work. <laughs> I feel like that's more insulting than like anything else. Ooh, got her. Yeah, Zoe, you like that? I just got you with my tip. Yeah, you like that? Fuck you. Mm. Got her with the tip. Oh, shit. This could be good. This could be good. She's after it. She's on the case. Yes! Yes, baby! I got that thousand gold shut down and oh me, oh my. Kaboom, hello. 
Where are you? Where are you running, huh? Where are you running, huh? <laughs> ba boom, bitch! <laughs> Three thousand two hundred gold. Ooh, I love you. I love you, Lulu. You know what? What are my rabbitons? Thirty-six hundo. I need just a bit more muns. Cause if I get this scuttle crab, and then oh, that's instant depression. Okay, if I get this top farm, and then potentially sell my Doran's blade, because <laughs> who needs AD when you've got AP? I should be nearing the amount of money for yes, precisely. Cause Doran's blade sells for 180. So if I'm 200 off. That is more than plenty. And I actually want to back and get these purchases done ASAP because we want that. We really, really want that. And I think we should go for it. Baron Nash were alive. Oh, I'm dead. Damn. I think maybe if I executed that combo a little faster that I could have potentially killed Zoe. Very potentially could have killed Zoe. I did not expect them to be there. I fully expected them to be prepping for the dragon. So, totally my fault. 100, 100, 100% 100 my fault. And at this point, I don't even need to sell the Doran's Blade because by the time I spawn, all I've naturally generated enough gold for the Rabidons. So, no reason to lose that 80 health or that staggering amount of 8 AD. So, 175 to 413 AP, baby. Let's go. Let's get it. I'm coming soon, team. Nice. Just shut down the Akali. As long as they just fight it front to back, front to back. Shivana knows where the threat is, and she is on it like white on rice. But Big Dog, smacking them down. All right. Well, here I come to ruin your Penta. No Pentas while I'm here. Huh. No! Fuck! Damn it! Oh, that was so close. Ugh. I was gonna try and kill him, but then that dragon was going down like instantly. So we lost that completely because of my fault, right? Like, because I got caught top. I made an assumption. I tried to make an educated guess on what I thought they would be doing because I didn't actually see them. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention again. Either way, my own fault. And that caused us to lose the fourth dragon. So really bad. Really bad. Where you at? Where you at? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Yo, that's one way to force out a teleport. With a Baron up? Yeah, dude, go ahead. Use that teleport. But I guess Shivana can solo Baron. Get Baron Vision? Oh, shit, I'm dead. Shiv can solo. Damn. Ugh. Oh, I almost killed her too. Damn. But we really need Baron Vision just because Shivana can solo it at like any time she wants. But Akali did R there. Almost got her. But you know what? Sorry, I forgot. She hits me with her E so she could literally teleport back to her base and then hit E again. And then she's just like... It's kind of like the sound of running barefoot on concrete, right? It's just like the... As she just flies back at you. I'm throwing this game, man. I've played too much League of Legends today. Too much League of Legends. The boy wonder. He's going for it. I mean, he can do it with the teammates there now. Because Shivana is dead, so they don't have the risk of a smite steal. But boy, I love that valiant effort of trying to solo it for a little while. He was just... He was doing the most, but good. That is good. What? What the? What the? What? What? Kill them. Kill them. <laughs> Bye. Ow. Oh, Akali. Kerblap. <laughs> if they're going to actually like blasting code in there, kill they asses. <laughs> Uh-oh. 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 Oh, 
I'm fine. I was fine the entire time. You guys thought I was worried. I wasn't even a little worried. I knew I was fine. <laughs> Calculated. Can I afford anything? Oh, I can afford my sandwiches. Net. I'm gonna go net. Grab this. And now we are a four item Lucian. 500 AP coming in from your boy. And I could actually go for just like flat magic pen here with a uh, Marilla Namicon because none of them have any MR. So that's that's an actual possibility for your boy. I'm, I'm considering it. I'm also considering going Lich Bane for the additional burst. Um, not sure it's the most cash money idea I've ever had, but you know. When do I do the right thing? I do the fun thing. Look at that staggering auto attack damage. Nice. They got the Akali, which is crazy good for us because that's like half their dive. I don't know what the enemy team just did, but they pretty much just lost the game. Way to go, guys. Wait, what is she doing? Girl! Girl! <laughs> Baby, what happened? What happened, girl? Oh, Jax. Oh, Jax. You are just going 10 belts above your league right now, my man. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. It was like actually watching an infant fight Mike Tyson. <laughs> G G. Boom. Ooh. Is he going for moi? For moi? Oh god. Oh lord. Uh okay. Never mind, game's not over. Hang on. Hip. <laughs> Bleed, nerd. <laughs> uh, I knew I wasn't getting out of that one. Might as well take her with us. But now, oh, dear God, they get a third infernal. <laughs> I wish I had that infernals, those infernals, not that infernals. Oh my god, look at me, the nine kill participation mid laner. Wow. Whew. It's getting hot in here. Did someone say raw talent? Because I know I sure didn't, Jesus. <laughs> Get my ass carried. But you know what, dude? Sometimes it do be like that. And we're still having a good time, and that's what matters. That is what matters. Jesus, three mountains and three infernals? Oh. What do I want next? I'm I'm almost feeling the gun blade. I really am. I think You know what? Sure, why not? Why not? Double gun Obama, meet triple gun Obama. This is now Pokemon, this is your evolution. Triple gun Obama. I actually wonder how much of Vayne's damage has been true damage this game. Because with people having so much health on their team, it's it's got to be a buttload. Right? It's just got to be so much. But I would very much like to be level 16. Because level 16 does get me five more shots of the tickling. So, we like that. We really like that. Fortunately, I don't need to get these minions to get experience from them. Thank heavens for that, too, because good lordy Lou. Oh. All right, flankle gank and inbound. Kaboom! Tackle nuke. <gasps> <clears throat> Not even a little scared, as usual. All right. Spankle tanking, here we go. 4,000 damage from the colon. Not bad. Oh, damn. Big dogs tickle in the tower. He out boom what what you gonna tell me that that one missed you go you gonna tell me that one missed girl kaboom got him Chunked. okay he's the drowsy I am not how much damage did I do to you come on show up I just want to see how much damage I did to her 
Damn, I almost killed her. Oof. Another 500 right there. Kaboom. Another 500 right there. Yo, 500 every six seconds. Not bad. I think that hit her. Yeah, it did. It put my Ludens on cooldown. So that did hit her. Let's get this Baronicus. And then siege up. Pressure. I can solo pressure. No, you cannot. My man, I appreciate and respect your audacity, but you cannot solo this. What? No, get, get in here. You're the smite. You're the fucking smite. Get in the pit. Holy shit, I got the Baron. <laughs> Bro. Tickled! Hey, baby. What's good? Oh, Lord, baby Jesus. <laughs> oh, Lord, he coming. <laughs> GG, well played, my dudes. Eight, five, and five truly was magical. And we will end the game with about 600 AP. Dishing out some gnarls Barkley damage to say the least. And I just want I just want one more good one. He up No <laughs> Wait, it doesn't work anymore. You can't do the dance in Bizonias after the game ends? I'm uninstalling. I'm uninstalling. Alright, I'm gonna honor this guy for tilt proof because if it weren't for him, if it weren't for him, I might not have got a first blood. Honor him for tilt proof. Eight, five, and five. You know what? I'll take that. I'll take that. Almost a thousand damage a minute as AP Lucian. Obviously, the vein popped off. She did really well that game. She literally cutie pie. Literally the cutie pie pop off. But as an 8, 5, and 5 AP Lucian pumping out almost 30k in, like, in 30 minutes, 33 minutes, we'll take that. We'll take that. We'll write that down in our book as a win. And I appreciate you guys for hanging out with me for this video. If you guys did enjoy it, do make sure you leave a like and a comment. It really does help me out. Before we leave, I wanted to see how much true damage Vayne did, champions. That was what I wanted to see. So, true damage to champions. 11,500. Cool, Vayne. Thank you, Vayne. Very cool. Thank you, Vayne. Very cool. All right. Just wanted to see that, though. As I was saying, if you guys did enjoy this, leave a like and comment. It really does help me out. If you want to, you can subscribe and ring that bell to be notified whenever I do upload a video. And as always, I love you guys, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Peace!